Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Um, I picked this bottle guard from my guardian. This is a homegrown uh, bottle guard or opo sa uh, Tagalog sa Pilipinas. So what we're going to do today, I'm going to show how I cut it and then slice it and freeze it. So I picked this um, bottle guard a couple days ago and there were two and but I give the smaller the a little bit smaller to my next door neighbor. Um, this is um Asian, which is a Vietnamese. So first thing first we're gonna cut this by portion. Cause see anyway, really big and really long. Okay. So we're gonna you know um we're gonna separate this first. You know guys, if I learn this to grow, siguro I know they will reach to four feet but I don't want to be like really big and also I like to be like young so that's two uh, this one's three um I cut this like this portion because it's a lot easier to remove the seeds and also the skin okay that's three then the fourth one Mm, it's kind of hard, but okay. okay. So there we go. So we cut four. As you can see it's really, really big, guys. See, so we're going to. Cut it, okay, like this. Again, it's a lot easier to remove the seeds. If you cut like this, okay, then that. Then we can remove the seeds. See how easy it is. Ganyan ang ano guys. Paglinis ng ano. Upo or bottle guard. Okay. Chaka ano tinatanggal ko yo. I remove the seeds. I don't want to be like cut it thin because this right this part here, it's also a sweet. It's bring the taste for your bottle guard when you're cooking with soup or steam, however um, how you cook it. This is really good even you cook this with soup and just add um, eggs. You know and put your seasoning like fresh garlic, onions, whatever you desire. So yeah, okay like that more okay and again I leave some of the in the middle because it is bring also the taste like the uh, part of this one of the tastiest because it's kind of sweet so yeah it's like that okay just remove some a little bit seeds left. It's just like that. Okay. Now, how to um, remove the skin? It's very easy. Just do like this. I cut a little bit thick, but okay, just like that. As you can see, it's faster. Okay. Then, we can cut this again. It depends how big you want, how big your slice, but I like to slice a little bit smaller. And then after this one, guys, I, we will wash it and then put on a Ziploc, okay? like that see guys how easy to peel it it's right there look at that it's quicker pag pinutol mo putulin mo yun tapos um, islis mo yung di masyadong malaki not too big tapos when you peel it it's faster ganyan okay then more And we can put this in a freezer. Even this, um, when you make some soup or just cook it like 
whatever desire do your recipe. Um, if your vegetables is frozen, do not wash it. You have to wash your vegetables before you put in the freezer. I will tell you why. The taste of the food, um, if you thaw it, it's it's not it's not very good. So when you're cooking frozen vegetables, you go directly the, to the boiled water. Okay. So this one, guys. It is a lot, guys. This just um. Ano pa to? Isang potol. It's the first one that I cut. Remember, we cut four portion because it's really big. So this is the first one. Okay. This um bottle guard guy. This is the twenty pounds of bottle guard that I pick in my garden. See, okay, you can see, guys. This is just one cut, okay? Remember we have four, so we have one, two, and three. So I'm just showing you how prepare a cut, prepare it, and freeze it. So I'm gonna wash this, this now, okay? So remember guys, if you're freezing some vegetables, Make sure you wash it before freezing it because you cannot throw, do not throw your uh, frozen vegetables because the taste is changing. So you just drop in the boiled water, whatever, if you're making some soup, you just drop that frozen vegetable directly to the boiled water. Okay, so we're gonna put this in a freezer and I portion the guys, I portion tie you just like one time use. Okay, so yeah. So probably this lasts for months, okay? Okay, this is fine. This is one use right here, half of the uh, large Ziploc, okay? And then we're gonna put this in the freezer. So it's kind of showing you guys, paano pagkat sa opo mo pag may malaki kang ano, mahamap, harvest the garden more and it's really nice when you have homegrown vegetables because you know exactly um, what chemicals you use uh, for your garden I don't use chemicals in my garden guys I do use um, organic fertilizer you can buy at the store and also I use a lot of cow manure yung tai sa baka so yeah okay so this is for just one cup we're able to, we're going to freeze this, so two, four, six, eight, eight bags. Eight bags will probably last this for like three, four months. I still have some in my freezer, guys. My first harvest, it was really big too. But I didn't really make a video how I cut it, so that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching in my YouTube channel. Um, again, I'm just showing you. If you harvest your homegrown vegetables that required to freeze it and peel it, that's exactly how I do it. So I don't know some of you, but that's how I do it myself. So thank you so much. Have a wonderful Sunday. If you didn't subscribe my YouTube channel, please give me a um, subscribe to my YouTube channels. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Thank you. Thank you so much. I love you guys. Take care. May God bless you all. Bye-bye.